Hi, my name is Taylor Cubbage and I am a fisheries biologist in the Sport Fish Division for the Alaska Department of Fish and Game. Today we are on uh, Campbell Creek in Anchorage. We're doing a foot survey counting salmon. During these foot surveys we are in the creek in our waders with uh, counters and we walk downstream along the creek in these sections and we record how many fish we see. We take these numbers to get an index of abundance. You know, how many fish are in this creek this time of year? Uh, it's very useful to conduct these surveys during the spawning season for these salmon. For example, we're seeing a lot of spawning uh, sockeye salmon. Fish are actively spawning in this area. They're in their bright spawning colors so, we th so that we can see them very well and, and count them much, much easier. And we conduct these surveys to get an index of abundance, to understand how many adult fish are coming back to spawn successfully. And uh, this gives us an idea of how many eggs they're releasing and how many juveniles are out migrating to the ocean and then coming back so that we can compare that data from year to year to get an understanding of how the stocks are doing to ensure that we can meet these uh, escapement goals that we have on these creeks. A lot of the trail systems in Anchorage cross many of these creeks, Campbell, Chester, um, and you can see these beautiful spawning fish, you know, along these trails in Anchorage. Such a great thing for um, the community of Anchorage to have access to these trail systems and these creek systems that have such, you know, vibrant fisheries in the heart of a city like Anchorage. Myself as a fisheries biologist, I obviously love these fisheries resources that we have in town, but it's everybody's um, enjoyment and responsibility, whether you're just enjoying the trails in Anchorage, seeing these fish in there spawning habitat or you're actively fishing for these species of salmon, it's so important that you know we, we protect them for future generations to continue to enjoy. So conducting these surveys allows us to, to better understand what's happening to these populations so that we can continue to uh, monitor and protect them so that they continue into the future.